So I'm filming in the dark because I've turned my Sphero bowl into a cockroach. Let me show you. So there he is, flashing blue, really, really happy. And if Dan, can you turn the lights on? Now he's automatically programmed to run away from bright light. So he goes red in color and he randomly selects which direction to head off into until such time as his light sensor says it's dark. And there you go. He's found a little space inside our cockroach enclosure where he's, he's happy. Dan, can you fetch him out and just, uh, I should say at this point that no harm came to any robots in the making of this, um, this film. So if you put him in the middle again, you see there's too much light, so he's instantly off and he's found it, found a place back there again. Let's see if we can fetch him out once more. Let's put him over there. You can't get out that side. Obviously a bit sluggish in the, uh, in the lights here. Get out that way and you can't get out that way. And down into this corner. A little bit dark and there's a bit of shade there but it's not dark enough for the robot and there he goes. And there he'll stay. So that's basically using the light sensor on a Sphero bolt to turn Sphero into a cockroach. And let's have a quick look at the code I've used there. In essence, I've set that if the luminosity, the light sensor is less than 100, sorry, is greater than 100 lux, then display red on the matrix. Um, and at the same time, choose a random direction between zero and 360 degrees and travel at a speed of 169 for a couple of seconds. And keep doing that basically else um, if the luminosity is indeed um, less than 100 then the light can go to blue and it can stop with a speed of zero which is exactly what it's doing there. <laughs>